Hey everybody, it's Gary the Google Guy here, and I have a little bit of an update, but it's more of a hidden feature that a lot of people aren't really aware of, and that is the ability to sort Google Sheets parameters using either text color or your fill color, which is your background color to the cells. So we'll consider this not necessarily a new update, but it's kind of a tip and a trick to use. So with that, I can just go ahead and select my rows and columns, whatever I want. We're going to turn my filtering on. And then from there, you'll notice in my column C, my column G, and then my column E. I've got some different ways of sorting my data with color. So in column C, I've got my text that is going to be red and then other text that's going to be black. So one of the filters that you can use, you will click on the filter button you'll see sort by color and you can do text color and you'll see that I've got either red or black as my options. So that's option one. Option two is in column E. I have two different types of colors here that I'm sorting with the green and the gold. If I click on my filter button, once again, sort by color. This time we're doing fill color. And you'll see that it's got my light green and my gold color there that I can sort from or any white cells that are there. Lastly, if you use any type of conditional formatting, maybe like a high low type of value or a hot cold type of value, same kind of thing you'll see in column G that I have that. Once again, I go to my filter button sort by color and underneath fill color you'll see it gives me every range of color that it's using under the rainbow there that I've selected to find the exact type of color that I'm looking for. So once again not really a brand new update but it is one of those hidden pieces that a lot of people overlook. You have the sort by name A to Z and Z to A. You'll different values underneath. Your color is fairly new with the filter by color but you can also sort by color as well. So just wanted to bring that up for you. Hopefully give you another way of looking at your data. And also this is available in both your Google Sheet format files as well as you'll see in the upper left here my Microsoft format files that I've got up in my drive. Until we meet again another day another time another update or a tip or a trick. This is Gary the Google Guy signing off.